Everything it seems these days can be delivered to your door. How about car repairs? We're back with another Textination interview. I'm Fred Fishkin, and with us is Joel Milne, CEO of RepairSmith. Thanks, Joel. Thanks for having me. So tell us what RepairSmith is all about. I think I've dropped some hints here. Sure. Well, RepairSmith is the most convenient way to get your car repaired because we come to you. So uh, we've combined e-commerce with on-site at-home delivery so you can easily go online, you can get a price up front, you can book your appointment, and then our technician will show up in a fully equipped mobile repair van that can handle almost all jobs in the driveway. What's the story behind this? The story behind it is um, about three years ago, uh, I teamed up with uh, a group out of Mercedes-Benz, Daimler, uh, that was looking at modernizing the repair space. And we spent about a year figuring out how to do it. And about two years ago, we launched to the public in California first, and now we're in about seven states across the country. And you're not specific to Mercedes, I assume? We are not. We, we handle all makes and models after 1996. Wow, that's, that's, a, that's a pretty wide range. So how does this work? Tell us for, from the consumer experience side, how this all comes together. What do yeah. they do? They, they go to repairsmith.com. Uh, they tell us about their vehicle and what service they're looking to have done. So it can be anywhere, anything from as simple to an oil change to you know, a full transmission rebuild. Almost no matter the job, um, we will handle it 90% of the time in the driveway. For a very long, big job, we might take the vehicle away and bring it back when it's done. But from a customer perspective, you never have to go anywhere. And that was a really important um, cornerstone to thinking about this service when we were envisioning it was there's no dead ends. We don't come out and say, oh, we can't do this. And then you have to start over and go to a shop. So. We handle pretty much everything. We don't do collision. and there, We'll tell you some things we don't do up front, but anything you can get done at a good repair shop, generally speaking, we can handle. Uh, and then, you know, you make your appointment, technician comes, uh, you review the work when it's done, you get a full inspection report afterwards of any additional items we may have found that we recommend, and uh, but a health report for your car and, you know, payment is uh, entered in advance. So you, you approve the job and you're done. So from your perspective, how do you put this team together yeah. to, to, to make all this happen? Well, you know, uh, it, 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 the question I get asked all the time is, why hasn't somebody done this before? Or This is the way, you know, our customers love it. And they say, this is the way it should be. You know, I can't believe no one's thought of this before. And, and it's hard. The, I think I'm sure people have thought of it before, but doing it right is hard. Car repair is not, you know, delivering food. It's a highly skilled, you know, highly uh, trained profession and you don't want to mess people's cars up. Right. And so you want to do uh, highest quality standard work within a convenient format. And so all of our technicians are employees, uh, you know, with full benefits and all the kind of things you might see at a, you know, a compensation and, and arrangement you might see at a dealership. So we're not sending out independent contractors or people with their own pickup trucks and tools. We're sending them in our employees who are trained by us and are all ASC certified technicians in a vehicle that's generally a brand new Mercedes Sprinter van or similar, uh, fully equipped with all the tools, you know, the power, the fluids, the, you know, compressed air, the computer system for diagnostic, all those components you need to do high quality car repair. Really interesting, yeah. but it, it sounds really challenging to, to put this together then. So how many markets are, are you in today? Uh, today we are in, well, we're in seven states right now, uh, generally speaking from the Pacific Northwest around to uh, the Southeast. So um, uh, Texas, Arizona, California, uh, Oregon, um, and Nevada. And the plans? Oh, and, Detroit, and Georgia. For our newest market, uh, Atlanta, Georgia, launched uh, uh, shortly, uh, recently. So we're also in Atlanta, Georgia. And how, how many people do you have working with this? Can you disclose that? Sure. I mean, we're, we're over 300 people right now, and we're opening new markets every month. 
It's fantastic. So tell us how you're going to grow this out, how, how it happens. Do you go in and then you advertise uh, in an area for, for mechanics and how do you, how do you vet them? Yeah. Uh, well, you know, our, our head of quality and service um, is a former master technician from Mercedes uh, who 20 years ago, you know, over 20 years with Mercedes um, and, you know, has been in various management roles at, at Daimler Mercedes. And, you know, he sets the program for, for recruiting, training and retention in our company. So, you know, we, we have somebody who's an expert at, at um, training technicians and um, employing technicians as part of our team. Uh, but, you know, we have, a, we have a recruiting process that we're hiring experience, generally speaking, mechanics with over 10 years of experience in a multi-brand environment, you know, a good independent shop. And we're offering them a different way to work rather than being back of shop at one location, you get to go out and visit the customers on site and interact with the customers directly and, and um, you know, have kind of a modern future vision of the industry where we think it's going and be part of that. That sounds really, really interesting. Back to the customer's perspective. Yeah. Is this going to cost me a lot more than I would pay if I went to a garage down the road? Not at all. You know, our brand principles are um, fair price. So we're not the highest and we're not the lowest in any city. We're, we're, we're pretty much average for a good independent shop. Uh, we have high quality repair and we have a completely unique delivery format. So more or less, you should be paying around the same price by getting it done at your home. And very often when you go to get something fixed, if it's not something like an oil change, et cetera, there's, a, there's an issue getting the parts, you know, got to send out for the parts. I imagine you run into the same thing with what you're doing. Yeah. So, you know, about 40% uh, of the time, uh, a visit doesn't require parts, whether it's a diagnostic or an oil change or, or, or stuff that we carry on hand, I should say. Um, about 60% of the time we have to schedule it and order the parts in advance, right? And so uh, we will order the parts. They'll be loaded up for all the appointments that day. They'll be loaded onto the van and they'll show up with the correct parts. How are you going to build this out through the rest of the country? And what is it? What's the time frame look like? I know you said you're moving pretty fast. Yeah. And end of next year, we hope to be in every major metro in the country. And that would include most, most states, uh, Throughout the U.S.? Yeah. So, I mean, any city that has any, any 2 million plus city in the U.S., right? So, um, uh, it's about 100, you know, a little under 100 cities, uh, major, me sorry, should, major metros, not cities, because each major metro has many individual cities. Uh, but yeah, uh, by the end of next year, you know, by the end of this year, we'll be about halfway there. That's really terrific. So do you have a program with the, how do, what should mechanics know who might be interested in working with you? Uh, what do you have a program you provide the equipment, vehicles, et cetera, or make it available to them? How, how yeah. does this all happen? Yeah. So they, they can, um, you know, apply on our website. Um, they'll go through a pretty standardized interview process and, you know, we pay competitive salaries. We have healthcare benefits, um, you know, very good compensation package, but also a great work environment, right? Where they get a mod, a brand new, you know, all of them within a year or two old uh, van, Mercedes van, fully equipped with new tools and equipment to get the job done. And we have ongoing training support. And they're, they're you know, like I said, I think a lot of our technicians feel like they're part of something that is bringing, modernizing an industry that hasn't seen much disruption, right? That, I mean, the basic model for car repair hasn't changed in 50 plus years, right? It's, you call up the shop and, and they say, bring it on down, we'll take a look. Or, you know, you, you're just driving by and you pop in. And, you know, we think that, that customers want and deserve a lot more than that. Very interesting. So we look forward to, to the continuing growth and everybody listening, I'm sure, or viewing this is going to say, boy, I can't wait for them to get into my area if you're not there yet. The website, that people should go to is where? Repairsmith.com. Easy enough. Thank you so much for taking the time with us, Joel, and continued success with your innovation. Well, thank you so much.